I'm uh, Robin from the Voltex Marketing Department, and today we are super excited to be bringing you this webinar with one of our internal uh, divisions, which is Vibe Miller, South Africa. Uh, we will be presenting today alongside Trevor and Pete, and as usual, we will be having our usual Q&A session at the end. So please do feel free to drop any questions you have in the chat and comments throughout, and we will address them at the end. Of course, you can shop the Vibe Miller uh, range through Voltex, our branch network, as well as our online store. And if you have any uh, special questions, feel free to direct them through to marketing at voltex.co.za and we will put you in touch with the relevant people. But that is it for my side, and I'm going to hand over to you guys. All right, thank you. Just um, wait for that uh, slideshow to come up, please, Robin. Can you put that up on, on the presentation sure. for us? Thank you. It, I got to say that uh, most of the time when you and I have done uh, Microsoft Teams meetings and stuff, I've only ever seen you down to sort of neck. And now that you're showing me the rest of it, it looks like you lost a bit of weight, eh? <laughs> yeah, it's amazing what uh, 10 k early morning can do after lockdown, eh? Yeah, the rest of us have gone the other direction. That's why I'm keeping my video up to there. <laughs> 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 Okay, so shall we begin? It's uh, a very good afternoon to our colleagues from our group companies and our most amazing customers. I am Wes Ready, and I'm gonna be presenting this webinar today. We extend a warm welcome to you on behalf of the management and the entire Pambili Weidmuller team. It's really so amazing to have such a diverse range of people attending. I know we have uh, some consulting engineers today. We've got panel builders some contractors and much more. So you're all here, yay. <laughs> thanks, for, uh, thanks for being here, we, we really appreciate you. Now, also joining me um, from Pambili for backup and support is the Pambili sales manager, Peter McDonald. I know that many of you know him, a lot of the Durban customers know him very well. And I also have our automation product manager, Trevor Gleason, who's also joining me as well. So if this were a radio show, it would probably go something like this. Great to have you along on the Weidmuller afternoon drive today. Lots of great news about Weidmuller products on the way. We'll also find out what's going on in your sport with Peter McDonald. And covering your traffic on the roads is going to be Trevor Gleason. So right now, let's check out what's going on in your sport. Pete, what's going on in the world of sport? Hey, Wes, on the sports front, there's uh, still unfortunately not much to report on. But uh, on the positive side of things, um, it's probably been at least six weeks since Owen Farrell's used his shoulders, uh, sorry, I mean arms in a tackle. And um, on the sports, on the, on the, on the cricketing front, uh, word on the street has it that our old mates, uh, Steve Smith and Dave Warner, have turned to hand sanitizer instead of sandpaper to punch on each other's, uh, sorry, I mean their team's balls. Um, so, yeah, it seems as if Sonny Bill Williams will have the last laugh after all. But uh, okay, where's it over to you? Thanks, Pete. And uh, to see what's going on in your traffic right now, let's find out what's going on on the roads. Trevor, what's the roads looking like? Well, where's, where do I even start? I hope that we have enough time for this one. Traffic, to say the very least, uh, is a breeze. And the only cars on the road are Army, the police, and the rapidly fast Blue Light Brigade. And I absolutely promise you guys that this is not a past report from the, from the public holidays. From my side, thank you to everyone for joining us today. We appreciate you taking the time to get to know our business. And thank you for connecting with us. Back to you, Wes. Right, thanks so much to Trevor. There's your uh, sport and your traffic. Okay, so uh, let me help you with uh, the controls. Hopefully you've gotten the hang of how this interface works. You will see that there is a, a text box or some controls on one side of your screen. And that means that you have the ability to uh, put a question there or a comment. And uh, there's a little menu as well. So we will be taking some questions from you when we are done. And if you're worried that you might forget the question, then simply type it as you have it, and our team will flag it, and we'll make sure that we get back to you later. So to test that this all works, I, I saw some uh, very uh, polite responses from a lot of you when you joined, and I'd like to thank you for that. Uh, but please respond now. Many of you know that uh, when you're using text, you use the, the colon sign, a minus sign, and a, and a bracket that gives you a smiley face. So in terms of how you're feeling right now, uh, here we go. I'd like you to please give me some response and uh, let's see how everyone's doing today using your text box. How is everyone feeling today? Yeah. 
Okay, I had to make that noise by myself because it's kind of lonely here. But um, I'd like you guys to please put in some smiley faces. Thank you, thank you, Dion, for that. And uh, to some of you other great people that have joined us today, put in your smiley faces in the box. Okay, so we'd like to thank you for taking the time to attend our webinar presentation today, wherever you are attending from. We hope that you and your families are safe and well during this time. Let me tell you about uh, something that happened during the lockdown in April. So Weidmuller Germany were doing webinar training sessions very similar to this every day. And a lot of our staff, including myself, we had to attend these on our laptops from home. I think, I think many of you were doing this, okay? So these were just over an hour long. Now, since the organization that was hosting it, which was Weidmuller Germany, had to silence the audio, just like we did now, uh, of the attendees, because let's be honest, your dog could be barking in the background, your missus could be shouting at you, and this would disrupt the entire presentation. So audio from the attendees couldn't come through, and the video was also blocked off. So just like this, you could only see the presenter. So during this time, this friend of mine wanted to know, during the presentation, if he needed to go to the bathroom and he needed to sneak away, and while he was there, he thought, you know what, it's two o'clock, I might as well do my shower for the day. And he had some lunch on the way back as well. And by the time he got back, the presentation was basically over. Question my friend had was, would anyone know? Now, just like my friend, the reason I'm telling you this story is that maybe you have the same question today, okay? So right at the beginning, I'd like to give you three important reasons as to why you should not do this and you should stay where you are and enjoy the next 30 minutes with us. So this presentation, number one, is only 30 minutes long and I can guarantee you it should go by quite quickly. Number two, we are not trying to give you full product features and descriptions today. That is saved for a product training session. This is just an overview of what we have to offer. And number three, Weidmuller has a very vast and interesting range of products. And I'm sure that there's something of interest to you that you will see where you will say, I know somewhere that I could use that. And now you know where to find it. So great to have you here. Let's get into our presentation for the best connections with Weidmuller. So it's good for you to know that Weidmuller has been in South Africa for more than 50 years. And our staff are well-trained and they have the expertise and the technical ability to offer solutions and support for all our products. So there are a few brand names and logos on the screen here that you see. And I want to point out that one of the biggest brand names that we are known for is Clip-On. There's a lot of history in this name. And most of you know the SAK 2.5 terminals. You could go as far as saying Weidmuller invented the DIN rail mounted terminal block called the Clip-On terminals. So in South Africa, we are known for many different names, in fact, like Clip-On Electrical, RAD Interface, some of you would be aware of, Pambili Interface, we're part of the Voltex Group, we're part of the Bidvest Group, and I know it can be a challenge sometimes with customers knowing what name to call us, but it doesn't matter what you call us, as long as you call us, okay? So can you imagine on a day-to-day -day basis, customers call up and say, hi, is that, is that Clip-On? Yes, yes, sir, it is. Is, is that RAD Interface? Yeah, it, it certainly is, sir. Uh, is, is that Pambili? Yes, yes. Hi, are you guys, are you guys Weidmuller? Yes, yes we are. Uh, are. Are you part of the Bitvest group? Yes, yes we certainly are. Hi, is that Voltex? No, no, no. It, it most definitely is not. All right. But what is important uh, for, you to, uh, for you to know is that Weidmuller is and always will be the main product and the main brand for us. And we are the sole distributor of Weidmuller for Sub-Saharan Africa. We provide full technical support and backup for Weidmuller products. And we also have some third-party brands and products that complement the Weidmuller range. Now, you see some of those brands on the screen now. These products are, are, are products that customers rely on us for. And they're really high quality and they complement the Weidmuller range. So it's products like slotted trunking that go into panels, panel air conditioners and fans from Fannenberg, heat shrink, flexible conduit, and there are a few more as well. So I think it is important to inform you that Weidmuller products are designed and manufactured for industrial use. And whether it's a bootlace ferrule or a high-end automation product like remote IO, all of them carry industrial specifications for the materials they're made of. 
their technical capabilities like IP ratings, corrosion resistance, and a lot more. And all of them have been tested in laboratories for extreme conditions. In plant or factory industrial environments, you'll hear a lot of people say things like, we have a high chemical content. We have a highly corrosive environment where everything rusts, a highly flammable environment. It's very dusty. There's a high water content because people are constantly hosing machines at high water pressure. It's a highly acidic environment. The box needs to be submersible up to two meters. And what about impact resistance? Now let's talk about impact resistance for a second. In industrial environments, especially in Africa, we know that people are very rough in the way they handle machinery and equipment. So just like the army and police during lockdown, they scop and donor everything. So <laughs> impact resistance is very important in plants and factories. So highly industrial plants and factories, like for oil and gas, automotive, energy, machine building, is exactly where Weidmuller products are designed for. And these are the industries like you see here that we are really successful in. So what you think Weidmuller is, might be very different from what it actually is now. In fact, it is a whole lot more. You must be familiar with companies that have a little bit of everything. For example, there are a few companies that do terminal blocks. And in their all-in-one catalog, you will find a section on terminal blocks that's possibly about four pages long. Weidmuller's dedicated catalog on terminal blocks, would you believe, is 500 pages long. Now, I know what you're thinking. We're probably listing the same stuff in 60 different languages, right? It's not. The same Weidmuller catalogs that have relays in them, dedicated relays catalogs, dedicated power supplies catalogs, dedicated surge protection catalogs, and many more are very in-depth because Weidmuller specialize in what they do. Now, I mentioned SAK 2.5 as clip-on and some of the first products, but look at what Weidmuller has become now in terms of the products they do and that they're specialists in. Products like relays, power supplies, Ethernet switches, remote I.O., signal conditioning, junction boxes, solar products, marking systems, even HMI screens. We have a picture of one of them on the slide. Energy management, and Weidmuller even now has a PLC. So one of the few companies that also has EX and hazardous area products, Weidmuller has really grown a lot since the clip-on SAK 2.5 that you are possibly familiar with. So since we possibly were the ones that invented terminals, I thought let's talk about it for a little bit. When it comes to terminals, to many people in our industry, a terminal is just a terminal, but it can get rather technical sometimes with customers asking for really specific, unique solutions like People want a resistor terminal or a diode terminal. Some customers ask for a triple level terminal with an earth connection. They want a screw bridge, a plug bridge, an LED, a terminal that's pluggable on one side. Maybe they need a stud type connection for a ring lug to go over it or a push on tab connection. So almost daily, we have customers calling us asking for something like this. They would say, I need a double decker fuse terminal. I'm needing to bridge the top and bottom level separately while having the fuse level pluggable, and I need a 110 volt AC LED for fuse blown indication. And lastly, is this Pambili or Weidmuller? <laughs> so we specialize and we have almost every possibility and every variation you might want or need. And that's why the catalog has 500 pages of different terminals and accessories. And it's the same in the relays catalog and the power supplies catalog. There are so many different types of terminal connections for wires screw clamp, spring clamp, push-in, spring-loaded, stud type, and the list goes on. And we have them all. Once again, we are the specialist in our industry for these products. So what we're showing you here is the latest technology on terminals, which is just a push-in connection. You may have come across it, and all you do is take your wire, push it into the terminal clamp without having a screwdriver, and it saves you a lot of time and money. And yes, it does come in a double-level fuse terminal 
with all the bells and whistles. So there has been significant development in terms of terminal technology as well. So when it comes to power supplies, again, Weidmuller specializes in every solution you might need in a high-end power supply for an industrial application. Weidmuller has battery backup units for power supplies, diode modules for parallel connections to have redundancy, variable output voltages, short circuit protection, many different output voltages like 5, 12, 15, 24, and 48, and a very wide input range as well. So you can put in anything from 85 up to 260 volts AC or DC on almost any unit. And there's also many current ratings from 0 0.5 amp all the way up to 40 amp with many sizes in between. So here you see Weidmuller product ranges displayed for surge protection, relays, remote IO, signal conditioning, and much more. Again, when it comes to specializing in a product, Weidmuller is one of the best. You know lots of companies that do relays, for example, but Weidmuller has all the standard relays that are interchangeable with others, and they also have safety relays. They have relays that have a signal built in to tell you when the relay contact is switched. And one of the only companies to have a relay with a universal coil that ranges from 12 to 250 volts AC or DC. So you could keep one relay in stock and it would work with almost any coil that you needed. And when it comes to surge protection, you may also know a few brands that you are familiar with. But Weidmull is one of only a few that does surge protection for very low voltage, for analog and dig digital signal surge protection. We've even got ethernet and even phone line surge protection. You can imagine this catalog is also quite big. So we have signal conditioning that isolates analog signals like 4 to 20 milliamps in, 4 to 20 milliamps out. We have units that convert them from say 0 to 10 volt to 4 to 20 milliamps. We have a multifunction unit that can be set for a few different or a hundred different input and output signals. We have safety barriers to isolate analog signals from hazardous areas to a safe zone. And Weidmuller is fully capable of integration into industry 4.0 by having wireless and ethernet connections on a lot of electronic products. So you can monitor them remotely and you can talk to each other with them as well. Now, energy monitoring is a very hot topic. All over the world and in South Africa, companies are being charged a carbon tax on their usage. So there's also a big drive towards clean energy. So Weidmuller have an amazing range of energy monitors to monitor power consumption, and you and your customers need to monitor your power usage to see where it goes and where you can minimize unnecessary usage. We have the products, the software, and the technical expertise to guide you and help you with your power usage. They're easy to use and easy to set up and can be monitored remotely. So besides all the awesome hardware that Weidmuller has. They also have some amazing software. And one of the best ones that you see on the screen now is the Weidmuller software called the Weidmuller Configurator. This software allows customers to design rails in panels or junction boxes and add all of the Weidmuller products with a simple drag and drop functionality from the database with all the technical specs. You can convert and export this to an order with a bill of materials and export the design into CAD or ePlan. So if this is of interest to you, make sure you get in touch with us to get your copy of the Weidmuller Configurator, and we're more than happy to guide you online on this type of platform into how to use it simply and easily so you can start using it immediately. It also shows you um, what your rail will look like in 3D and what your sizing will be like on the rail. So free to download, like I mentioned, and we do offer training and support on the Weidmuller Configurator. So please do take advantage of that. So through most of the presentation so far, I've been telling you about how Weidmuller is obsessed with innovation and specializing in a product. They basically like to do things to their best ability with any product. And here's another example. 
These plugs are ones that many people know as Harting plugs, okay? And they come in standard 10, 16, or 24 pin, and so on. And Weidmuller has all of that, and they are interchangeable as an industry standard. So this was not enough for Weidmuller, of course, because they thought, why have the plug limited to the amount of pins and the size of pins and the type of connections? Why can't you have a USB plug, a large power connector, a fiber set, an Ethernet plug, and all of that in the same housing with the correct electrical insulation and isolation for all of it? Well, Weidmuller does this in a modular plug where you can make it up like Legos and put it into a standard housing that make them IP67 with a very high corrosion resistance. So once again, another example of how Weidmuller likes innovating and specializing in their products. So here you see cable ties. I didn't have too much more to say about cable ties. <laughs> all right, so amongst all of this fancy automation products and the new innovations from Weidmuller, we also have an amazing range of cable ties. And I do have something interesting to point out on it. One of the few uh, manufacturers in the world that make cable ties out of a material called polyamide as opposed to PVC. And what this means is that, is that it has a much higher UV rating. It does actually have a lot more strength than PVC cable ties. And it has a lot of uh, standards and approvals on them. So you can take advantage of ordering cable ties on the Voltex website and you can get in touch with us on them as well. And um, it is really is very uh, useful to anybody and everybody. So take advantage of the, the Weidmuller cable tie range and make sure you go ahead uh, and order some now. I'm sure we'll be uh, more than happy to hand out a few free samples to you uh, if you send us a message or an email. Uh, hopefully my boss didn't hear that. But yeah, we'll be happy to, to hand some of them out to you. Okay, so earlier I mentioned to you about how some third-party products that are not the Weidmuller brand, uh, Weidmuller internationally has partnered with some strategic companies to give us products that are relevant to panels and junction boxes, like slotted trunking, panel fans and air conditioners, signaling and sounders, panel building tools like DIN rail and trunking cutters, and more. So even though these are not Weidmuller branded products, they are of a very high quality, and therefore Weidmuller do business with them, and we offer great support and backup on them, together with great stock levels locally on these products. So if it surprises you that you got a Fannenberg fan from Weidmuller, who is Pambili, who is Bidvest, who is Clip-On, that is totally normal, I can assure you. <laughs> so finally, I want to talk about a product range that fits into what's probably the biggest topic worldwide, and that is clean energy. There are some very large and impressive solar farms that have been built mainly in the Northern Cape in South Africa, and we've been a part of almost all of them. Weidmuller has solar connectors, DC surge protection, intelligent monitoring for solar power, complete combiner boxes for solar strings, tools, cable, and much more. In fact, within our group of companies, we have almost everything needed for solar installations. So over the next few slides, I'm going to show you some of those projects now with the scope of products that we supplied, the value we supplied, and a little bit of innovation and information. Uh, some information like the megawatt outputs of those solar farms um, and the power they produce. And uh, again, you probably don't think of Weidmuller for this type of product. And it has become a very big part of Weidmuller's business worldwide. So take a look now at some of these projects and you can uh, get some information on where they took place, the value, the outputs, and so on.
So this is quite an interesting project that we were involved in for a solar installation for a large Bidvest laundry based in Edenvale in Johannesburg. And our divisional manager, Mr. Derek Mulligan, was involved from the start with the design and implementation of the project. The laundry are now enjoying excellent gains and savings from the installation, and they are very happy with it. There are similar plans for other Bidvest buildings like this one, and this one is being used as a pilot project. So that wraps up our webinar presentation for today. I told you it would be very quick, and I'm glad you didn't run off to the bathroom, hopefully. <laughs> uh, on behalf of uh, Pambili and Weidmuller, I'd like to say thank you very much for attending, for giving us your time and attention, and it really is highly appreciated by us. It is also our first time that we've run one of these, and it was great for you to be a part of that. Uh, Peter and Trevor are with me, like I mentioned, so... Uh, hopefully you have some questions for for us that we can uh, we can try and answer for you. And Robin is also here, so yeah. Oh, please. Just before we even get to the questions, I just wanted to say that was really really awesome. Um, thank so you. thank you guys for coming on with us and for that awesome presentation. It's always uh, nice to see everything that Vide Miller does and what you guys have been up to. Um, we do have a couple of questions that have come through, but uh, to anyone who's watching, please do feel free to send through your questions now. Um, and I do see a couple of questions that did ask uh, about slow connections. Um, we will make a replay link available for anyone who did register for this. It will be emailed to you uh, later today. So uh, if you'd like to rewatch it, it will be there. I'm sure Wes will give it a watch as well so you can uh, see his no, presentation I, I, skills I, I, himself. <laughs> I definitely would. So you say there were some complaints about slow connections. Yeah. I got to tell you that in Durban, um, connection is actually a slang for a relative, right, Pete? Correct. <laughs> so, so a slow connection is a, a relative that when you tell him a joke, it takes a long time to get it. That's a slow connection. <laughs> in Durban. Oh, sorry, Wade. I meant, I meant, I meant to English. <laughs> Thanks so much, Bruce. I see Bruce is saying thank you. Thanks so much to you guys for, for attending. We really appreciate you being here. And hopefully it was quite informative to tell you how much more Weidmuller is than just uh, just terminals. So, Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, Keshni here did say, hey, Wes, would you be able to say your, share your presentation at the end of this webinar? As I mentioned, we will 100% have a replay link made available. And if you would like a copy of the presentation, please do feel free to email marketing at voltex.co.za and we can uh, sort something out for you. Um, we've got a question here from Henny. I don't know who wants to take this one, but it's how does stock availability work if we have to order through Voltex and ETA if parts have to be ordered from you? Peter, let you handle it, Peter. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I think traditionally you'd obviously have to phone uh, your local Voltex branch to get in contact with us, but uh, you can expect, uh, I'd imagine, a two to three days uh, delivery on any stock that we hold uh, locally. I think uh, anything more than that, obviously, we'll discuss in the quotation itself if it needs to come from Germany, but like we said, we do hold uh, AI items and B items, we do hold quite a lot of stock here at, in in a, a business park in Lindbergh Business Park. So, yeah, I would imagine a two to three day um, delivery would be would be right up there. Thank you, Peak, for that. Uh, a question here from Sylvana. She says, how old is Weidmiller? I know there's an international answer and a local answer. So how about we go with both? <laughs> Send it with. It's an interesting question because um, obviously, um, the uh, colleagues of mine know that I've been I've been to the Weidmuller factory a few times, and one of the great things is they take you on a tour of how the company started. It was a family business um, that was started up, and I see Trevor's typed a, a very nice message there explaining uh, how Weidmuller started. So I, I got to be honest that I'd have to be guessing, but it's got to be more than a hundred years old. Uh, there was talk of World War One uh, when when Matthias, uh, our German colleague, is 
told us stories of when it started, but it, it really has been around for a very long time. So on the presentation, I mentioned that uh, it's, it's more than 50 years that we've been in South Africa. But Weidmuller, as a company, I, I mentioned Clip-On because Clip-On is a very, a very strong brand name worldwide for terminal blocks. So that actually started even before Weidmuller. So yeah, it's, it's definitely more than 100 years. That's a good answer there was. Um, I see a question, well, a request here from uh, Willem. He says, please contact him regarding uh, PV products. We will definitely uh, save your details and uh, share them with Wes to be in touch with you. And a lot of thank yous and, uh, from my side, and I'm sure the Vitamilla team, it is an absolute pleasure. Thank you all for joining us today. Um, and I think that is it for the questions. Is there anything from your guys' side you'd like to mention before we uh, sign off? With your message. No, I think again, just uh, just a big thank you uh, on behalf of uh, Pambili and Weidmuller uh, for having us. It really means a lot that you took the time to uh, to attend the presentation today, and hopefully we can we can get you into uh, some future ones as well. And we also wish you and your family safety and uh, good health. So thank you from my side and on behalf of Pambili and Weidmuller. Yeah, I reiterate with the sentiments. Thank you very much. We appreciate your time and. Uh, We'll chat soon. Thanks, Robs. We'll definitely Thanks, chat soon. Thanks. We'll definitely Thanks, chat soon. Thanks, guys. Take care. Cheers, Cheers everyone. Bye.